his way beyond the traffic, the cutback though, found Marcandi and his effort was blocked. Corner kick for Chesterfield, whipped in towards the front post and flicked on. And what a chance to present itself for Che Dunkley who was arriving at the back post. Nicely orchestrated here by Chesterfield and very nearly the opening goal. Salford have had to weather the storm in the early stages. Chance to break for Woodburn. Woodburn's pass into McElhaney. Opened up for Salford's Connor McElhaney here. And it was a good chance, but it's when he puts past the post. Thanks to spray the pass. Ball and it's a nice takedown here. Nelly Campbell plays on, and now Markandi, Markandi! Oh. With a dipping strike, it deflects over the top. Lovely build up again, and Markandi has been right at the heart of everything good for Chesterfield so far. Just couldn't keep the strike on target. Salford managed to evade the press. They'll pass through midfield, trying to go through the phases. Neatly done. And now the chance to break into Chesterfield's penalty area. The angle side to get the ball in. Good closing down in the end by Che Dunkley. And Luamba stopped in his tracks. Chesterfield into the box. And Dobra! He's unable to conjure the chance. Looked like he might do something here. Both teams have had their chances in the game. No goals just yet. and making his way forward, clipping to the back of the box. And Dobra may still do something with it here. Was he pushed inside the box, had a long look at the referee. His decision is not to award a penalty, and Fauna carries the ball away. Well, the initial cross led to this chance, but it dropped lightly for Dobra, who was still there waiting. No penalty here, said the referee. Here is Berry. Berry's pass into Dobra. Back with the tricky Chesterfield winger. Away it goes for Salford, who are under some pressure here. Gordon looking for a chance to break. He's found James Berry here on the left hand side. Berry's curling effort finds a way through. Just opened up, but James Berry took his chance, and Chesterfield leads. While well, things going ever so well for the new boys in League Two. And when the chance arrived, Berry snatched his moments. 
given far too much room here by Edwards, the fullback. And just look at the space in that corner. Chesterfield won soccer now. There was a yellow card for Curtis Tilt. There may be some more trouble here for Curtis Tilt, who receives very quickly a second yellow. And he's off. Well, he was booked during the celebrations, and Curtis Tilt quickly here looking to snap onto the ball. And off he goes, and things get a lot worse here for Salford. Hold into the box here, and what an opportunity to do something for Salford. We now have to turn and face up to the break that's coming. Woodburn gets the ball back, curls in a brilliant ball, gets a woeful touch. Berry, brilliant afternoon's work for him. Goal play too close to the goalkeeper from the corner. And Jamie Jones happy to gather that one up. Salford bringing the ball forward here. And there are a couple waiting inside the box. They're not needed. It's crept in, it's the substitute. Kelly Namai grabs a goal for 10-man Salford and he may well have just grabbed a point for his team too. Well, in this position, it looked as though he'd be dealt with by the Chesterfield defence, but it's spilled by the goalkeeper, Ryan Boots. Chasing. Hobson. Cries of shoot and the shot is coming, but it dips a bit too late. Angle goalwards. Make his effort. No test in the end. the last chance for Chesterfield to snatch this, pushed away by Jones and sent on his way. Oldacre has given the ball away, well this would be a turn of events. Off goes Salford now chasing and Taylor is looked after by Gordon and has won a free kick for Salford and it has to be said it's a free kick in a very good position. In actual fact, there is a blow from full time. And we are all done here when it looked as though Chesterfield had grabbed themselves another three points thanks to the goal from James Berry. Carl Robinson's side snatched it with a goal from Kelly Namai. Chesterfield won, Salford won. It's how it finishes.